Hey everyone, this is Anthony Francis with GameZone.com. Today we're going to take a look at how to transfer your save game for Dark Souls 2 between multiple or different computers. Why would you need to do this? Well, in Dark Souls 1 you might not have noticed it, but it was a great feature that you could move from one computer to the next, log into Steam, play Dark Souls if the computer had Dark Souls on it, and you could play your save game because it was all saved to the cloud. I have asked around the entire office, I have asked Andrew Clowther, the king of Dark Souls and Dark Souls 2 here in the office, if he knew about this and he said he wasn't aware because he doesn't use two different computers. So if you do use a computer at home or you use a laptop or maybe there's a friend's house you go to and you want to play Dark Souls 2, this is how you are going to move your save game. So you don't even have to be in Dark Souls to do this, um, but I just wanted to open up with something nice. So we're going to go ahead and quit the game because I'm on a keyboard. I don't want to go any further than the title screen with a keyboard and mouse. I do not want to play Dark Souls 2 at all. I don't even want to navigate the screens with a keyboard and mouse. Okay, rant over. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to uh, find our save game. Our save game is located here in our user uh, folder, which uh, we can, uh, which is called Game Zone for me. And over here, it's called App Data. So we're going to want to click on App Data. Now this folder is a little clear, and I'm going to go into a quick Windows tutorial real quickly so that you can see that window. In order to see that window, in order to see that file folder, excuse me, we're going to click Start, Control Panel, then we're going to click Appearance and Personalization, and then we're going to click Folder Options, or right over here you can see Show Hidden Files and Folders. So over here, Show Hidden Files and Folders and Drives. We have that checked off. You'd click Apply, and boom. So now that that's done, we can go ahead and see the app data folder. So we can see it now. Click on it. Click on roaming. Click on Dark Souls 2. Click on bunch of numbers and a letter at the end. Okay, boom, look at that. Doesn't look like much, but that is your Dark Souls 2 save file. So you're going to, from here, like any other file, you're going to want to, uh, except it's a very, very important file, you're going to right click on it. I would recommend copying it pasting it and doing this uh, after the string of numbers put parentheses and name it whatever you want but I would say name it your uh, uh, where you are kind of thing so call it work and from here that's pretty much it uh, take the file and you can email it to yourself I did this last night worked great I emailed this file to myself at home and I um, up I swapped out I took out my Dark Souls uh, file. So I renamed this file in here home and I removed it and put it on the desktop and then I took the other one and I moved it in. Or also you can give it a date and then you can just change the date so that if you have an updated file you can move it over however you want to do it. But the point is this is where that file is located. Go ahead and swap it out and then you can Trade it off, or if you beat the game, I don't know, sell it to your friends if you make a good character. I'm, I didn't tell you to sell your save game file. I'm not telling you to do that. But um, this is the way to do it if you have multiple computers. If you're burdened uh, with the multiple computer issue, uh, that just scared me, just dragging and dropping that into the recycle bin. That's, that's Dark Souls. That's Dark Souls. Uh, but um, I hope this helps you. If, you. if you have that issue, now you can go ahead and play Dark Souls 2. Uh, from the comfort of any computer, as long as that computer has the game, you can take your save game and move it over there. I'm Anthony Francis. Thank you for watching. I hope this helped you out. For more, go to GameZone.com. Thanks.